brother Honey, left and Eric Aguila pose for a portrait between greenhouses on the Hancock Farm in Bumpus Mills, Tennessee, Tuesday, October 24, 2017, photo, Lacey Atkins slash the Tennessean, by photo. Bumpus Mills, 10, Eric Aguila runs an outdoor improvement company in Clarksville, where he lives with his wife and two young children. 30 miles west, in the small town of Bumpus Mills, his younger brother Honey Aguila spends most of his year working on a tobacco farm as a seasonal worker. Each April, Honey travels 2,000 miles by bus to Bumpus Mills and stays through the fall before returning to his wife and four children in Los Arajanes, Mexico. Just two years apart, Eric and Honey share the same father and mother and were raised in the same home near Mexico's west coast. But Eric was born in California, and Honey was born in Mexico. While their lives have brought them both to Middle Tennessee, U.S., immigration law has determined a vastly different circumstance for each man. A link has been posted to your Facebook feed. Honey Aguila is one of close to 200,000 seasonal, foreign agricultural workers certified to cross the U.S. border in the last year to work on farms throughout the U.S. They fill a workforce need that has surged in the past four years as fewer Americans choose farm labor and immigration law enforcement picks up. Borders and laws have kept these brothers apart from their parents and their children at stages throughout their lives, but the policies in place have also allowed them to build a better life for their families. Juan and Rosalba Aguila met in Los Angeles more than 30 years ago. As Eric tells it, Rosalba, still a teenager, was from Mexico City and joined her brothers who came to California for work. Juan came from the small town of Los Arajanes to work with his brother in a wood trimming factory. While going through family pictures at the bunkhouse in Bumpus Mills, Tennessee, Friday, December 8, 2017, Pony Aguila comes across one of his parents that live in Los Arajanes, Mexico. Photo, Lacey Atkins slash the Tennessean. Eric, their first of four children, was born in Los Angeles. Two years later, when Rosalba was pregnant with Honey, the family returned to Los Arajanes, where they grew tobacco and watermelon. We were always with our family, our parents, Eric, now 31, said. We were always playing, doing whatever chore we have. As boys, Eric and Honey helped their father on the farm. When they weren't helping out their father, they would play hide-and-seek or pass the time by tossing rocks in buckets. At age 17, Eric Aguila returned to California. His father had hoped working in the U.S. would lead to a good future. The departure was difficult for both brothers, they said. It's hard leaving the only thing you know, after spending so much time with everybody, Eric said. You don't know when you are going to see them again. When you go somewhere, you don't have that protection, that comfort your family gives you. It's a scary feeling. Brothers Eric, Left and Honey Aguila walk back to the bunkhouse, where at one time they both lived on the Hancock Farm in Bumpus Mills, Tennessee, Tuesday, October. 24, 2017